Donald Cerrone set to enter the world famous octagon once again. Cerrone is very dangerous on the feet or on the ground. Solid Muay Thai, great submissions, and he's a very hard worker. He's been taken to the limit several times in championship bouts, and there is no quit in this guy. Donald Cerrone, fired up and ready to go. Florian making his way to the world famous octagon. Kenny Florian is a very aggressive striker, and we've seen him in many fights with those wicked elbows of his. We've also seen him win a lot with his rear naked chokes. He can finish fights quickly from any position. Kenny Florian ready to throw down and put on a show. Our Tale of the Tape is brought to you by Tap Out, an expression of combat known worldwide, now available at tapout.com. And now with the official introductions of our fighters, Bruce Buffer. And now, five rounds for the USC Lightweight Championship of the World. Introducing first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, Donald Cowboy Cerrone. And now, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist. He stands five feet, 10 inches tall. Weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting out of Boston, Massachusetts, Kenny and Poe Warrior. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of this contest is Eve Loving. You have seatbelt on the line, guys. Protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. I'm Mike Goldberg with Joe Rogan, and we're ready to get things started. Are you ready, sir? Are you ready? Donald Cerrone, Kenny Florian. And here we Fight. go. Kenny Florian's family has always been involved in martial arts. His father studied it for many years. Kenny played tennis and soccer as a child. In fact, he received a scholarship to play soccer at Boston College and graduated with a degree in communications and filled in for you on fighting. Wasn't so bad, was he? No, he's at Left hook, he's down! He dives in and delivers a huge shot. Moves into half guard here. He got reversed. Big right hand. Side control. He's got half guard. And, and he mounts. mounts. Oh, good hip escape from the bottom. Moved into half guard. Back to side control. Oh! Oh, nice use of the cage to get the reversal. And into full mount. Cerrone is cut. Cerrone keeps getting tagged on that cut. He is bleeding bad, Mike. Oh, he got reversed. Nice right hand. Moves into full mount here. Oh, he gets reversed. Great job on the reversal. Oh, reversal. Under two minutes remains. Oh, he got reversed. Half guard. Keep the half guard. And back to full guard. Boom! Oh! Full guard. Just over a minute remains. Oh, he got reversed. Reversal. Very nice. Half guard. Half guard. 
For the transitions to the full mount. Looking for the arm triangle. Trying to remain patient. Oh, he's out of it. Nicely done. Oh, he gets reversed. He ate that one. Our first round is in the books. Joe, we saw that round mostly centered around the ground game. Yeah, it's a pretty interesting matchup on the ground, Mike. Both these guys are highly skilled, and both are looking to finish. Push the pace. Push the pace on it. Got to keep those uh, hands up inside. The leg kicks are there, all right? The leg kicks are there. And keep now, on the ground, you can catch them all day long in that triangle and that arm bar. You can catch them all day long, okay? Got it all day long. Let's take a look at some of the action from that round, Mike. This was that counter. Such unbelievable timing on that. And here's that devastating counter strike. That is world-class striking right there. And here's that submission escape. Great display of ground defense here. Some good ground work in that round, Mike. The beautiful Shandella. We are ready for round two. Ready, sir. Are you ready? We start round two. Fight. This fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Tight in the clinch. Good takedown. Passes, moves into half guard. Good transition. He's in full mount here. Oh! Good job, hip escaping there. Moves to half guard. Now into side control. He's taking some big shots on the bottom. Man, that knee landed heavy. Oh, but he ate a left hand. Left. Oh, nice left and a right. And he's hurt. Nice knee to the body. Inside leg kick. Nice body kick. Just over a minute remains. Oh, big kick. And now he's answered. Trying to punish the midsection. He caught the leg. He's down. 45 seconds remains. Side control. Wow, that right hand. Into half guard. He's in full mount. Oh, reversal. Great reversal. Oh, he got reversed. Oh, he got They have fought for 10 minutes. Round two is over. A great display of grappling skills in that round. Absolutely, Mike. I love a good jiu-jitsu match, and these two are putting on a show. Push the pace. Push the pace on Now, on the ground, you can catch him all day long in that triangle and that arm bar. You can catch him all day long, okay? Good. Okay, he's tired. His legs are tired from trying to hold that big foot. Okay, push the pace. Push the pace on him. Let's take a look at the replay, Mike. Here is that counter strike that landed clean. And this was that nice counter. Just perfect movement here. And here's an example of perfect timing to intercept that incoming attack with a counter. Solid wrestling skills on display in that round, Mike. You're going back to the strikes. You're looking perfect. Ready to start round three. There's the beautiful Brittany. 
ready, sir. Are you ready? And we are set fight. for the start of round three. This is a championship fight, so it is scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Oh, oh, nice hook and an uppercut afterwards. Nice right hand. Good counter, though, Joe. Both guys staying in tight. Big right hand. He shoots in. Good sprawl. He's got his back. And now there's also a cut on Flory. Moves into full mount. Awesome control from the top. He ate that one. Control his posture. Little rubber guard. Oh, he gets reversed. Oh, good hip escape from the bottom. Moved into half guard. Oh, reversal. Side control. Oh! Nice right hand. Wow, that right hand. Okay, moves into the mount here. Oh, he got reversed. Boom! Under two minutes remain. Oh, mount. Oh, he got reversed. And he gets reversed. Oh, he gets reversed. Able to posture up. Oh, reversal. Moves in the half guard. Postures up. Florian is bleeding bad here. This does not look good. Great job on the reversal. 45 seconds remains. Oh, he got reversed. Get your feet on his head. Reversal. Very nice. Great reversal. Mixing things up nicely. Oh, he got reversed. Round three is in the books. That looked like a tough round for both fighters, Joe. Yeah, they're taking some pretty serious punishment. I don't see this going the distance. You gotta fight it off. You swim that arm over. Now, on the ground, you can catch him all day long in that triangle and that arm up. You can catch him all day long. If he gets that back, you fight that two on one. If he gets that body off, you gotta fight it off. You swim that arm over. Let's take a look at the replay from that round, Mike. This was just an unbelievable counter right here. This is flawless timing. Right here we see that tremendous counter shot land. That was some nice action from that round, Mike. Don't crowd him. Relax. Don't go for the big hook. Use the right hand. Hook. Ariane gets us set for round four. You ready? Ready for the start of fight. round four. This fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. Hey, he shoots. Down, He's got the clinch. Get him back and up and make him pay. And the battle for a Oh! Belly to belly again. Man, those are knockout punches, Joe. Vicious punches from the top, Mike. He's in the full guard here. Mission control, Joe. Oh, he gets reversed. Stay tight in there. Oh, reversal. He's in the full guard. Moves to half guard, into his guard. Side control. Nicely done. Nice knee to the body. Half guard. Oh, he got reversed. Transitions to side control. Oh, 
Oh, he's got an arm bar. It doesn't look like he's got it. It looks a little loose here. Wow, great job oh, done escapes. defensively. Nice right hand. And another. Those are doing damage, Joe. Side control. He's got half guard. Oh, he got reversed. Under a minute remains. Oh, he gets reversed. He's inside control here. Full mount. Oh, this is bad. Armbar. That is a tight, tight armbar. Exclusive on bar victory. We have a new UFC lightweight champion. Textbook Jiu Jitsu. Yeah, you see here, once he's got this, he's got the arm isolated. He arches his back, pulls it, extends the arm for the tap. Here you see it again, extends that arm and forced to submit. Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at 4 minutes, 42 seconds of the fourth round. Declaring the winner by tap out due to an armbar. And now, the new UFC lightweight champion of the world, Donald Cowboy Cerrone. Cowboy Cerrone is the new UFC lightweight champion.